Millions of designer mosquitoes are being set loose on the streets in Colombia. The team behind it wants them to feed on humans. Instead of killing all the mosquitoes, we're actually going to release more into your neighbourhood. And not only are they going to bite you, they're going to bite your elderly grandmother as well, as well as your six-week-old baby. Children are doing it too. Ya está el mosquito adulto. The adult mosquito is here, so we go out and set the mosquito free. The idea is not to spread disease, but to wipe it out. The city of Medellin in Colombia has a population of two and a half million, and that's just counting the humans. The mosquito population is many times that. So you might not expect to see crews all over town releasing even more mosquitoes. Every 50 metres or so, out the window of the vehicle, we take the lid off and set the uh, mosquitoes free into the environment and hope that they'll then go out, um, bite people. The mosquitoes all have a secret ingredient. Every one is bred to contain bacteria called Wolbachia. Wolbachia is safe. It occurs naturally and stops mosquitoes spreading diseases like dengue fever. For the mosquito to successfully transfer dengue between people, the virus has to grow in the body of the mosquito. What Wolbachia does is stop it growing. So if the virus can't grow in the mosquito, it can't be transmitted between people. So we can just stop transmission by putting Wolbachia into the mosquito. Injecting Wolbachia into mosquito eggs took thousands of goes. But once it was done, the mosquitoes that hatched from those eggs passed on the bacteria when they mated with wild, untreated ones until they became dominant. But introducing the treated mosquitoes to Medellin means releasing even more into a city where mosquitoes have caused repeated dengue outbreaks. So how do you persuade people it's a good idea? That's the job of local kids like Salome. They've been getting lessons in how to nurture mosquitoes. Delivered by Scott's team. They're taught not to be scared of them because these ones won't make you sick. These mosquitoes contain Wolbachia. What's Wolbachia? A bacteria. When this mosquito has Wolbachia, it can transmit any diseases. Not dengue, not Zika, not chikungunya or yellow fever. They're sent home with mosquito breeding kits. I've filled it with water up to the halfway mark and now I'm going to add the capsule. Then we're going to take it to the balcony. And after about four or five days, the pupae are born. And then after another day or two, the adult mosquito is there, ready to fly. So we go outside and let the mosquito go free. The children spread the positive message about these mosquitoes to their parents. I thought I was going to be invaded by flies, but once she explained the process and what the purpose of the mosquitoes was, I could see that it's a great project. And I wanted them around here and wanted them to give her more so that we could have them at home. This method has been used successfully to combat dengue in Townsville in Australia. But could Wolbachia become less effective over time? Any intervention uh, may become less effective through evolution. Oh, I'm fairly comfortable with that. If we could get 50 years of strong protection or vaccines that continue to be developed or other control measures, I think that would be a success that we'd all be very proud of. Thank you.